Nothing quite says the 4th of July like hamburgers and hot dogs, and the red boxcar here in Red Lodge serves up both. If you've been in Montana long, you know this is a popular spot, and it's beloved by the locals as the folks here at the red boxcar came to the rescue of many devastated by the recent flooding. Uh, we've been coming here 40 years, uh, love this place, it's awesome, uh, these guys came here since they were babies. The Red Box Car is a Red Lodge icon and has been serving up burgers and shakes on the banks of Rock Creek for the past 50 years. But this summer season did not start as expected. We came out Sunday evening and stood on the deck and said a few prayers and you know, we knew it was coming, so we just braced for impact. When Rock Creek spilled its banks two weeks ago, creating an historic flood disaster, waters narrowly missed the restaurant. As Red Lodge flooded, staff here didn't just sit back and watch it happen. They got to work, serving one free meal after another to emergency workers and residents affected by the floods. My first thought was, let's do what we can to help. And, and thankfully, you know, we weren't alone. Uh, we've got a great team of employees that they jumped in and donated their time and they helped make it happen. Kaler started giving out meals to people affected by the flooding, emergency responders and all the volunteers. Just how many meals did he give out? Kaler couldn't even count, but said upwards of 250 a day. Honestly, you know, I, I, we were just doing our part. There were so many people that were helping and it wasn't, you know, we get a lot of credit for it because we were a business, but there were so many individuals and families that were making food and, and helping and really it's, Honestly, it's not about us, it's about the community. I think the community pulled together as a whole and really just chipped in to help. Now, the Red Box is just one of the many Red Lodge businesses trying to hold on to the critical summer tourism season. Our sales are 45 to 50 percent of what they were this time last year. As the 4th of July weekend kicks off, loyal fans are here to help the community recover. We love the Red Box. They have such great burgers and milkshakes, one of my personal favorites. I just like to let everybody know that Red Lodge is a great little town. We're all open for business and we look forward to seeing everybody this summer. We're going to try to make the best of it. And hopefully the whole town has a great summer. In Red Lodge, Phil Van Pelt, MTN News.